I'm Brittany. I first started doing henna when I was in high school, sophomore year. So basically, I was bored in class one day and I took a pen and started writing on my hand. Basically, the henna turned out great, but I wanted to actually pursue in doing henna for real. So then I told my mom to buy me henna and I would practice on myself and her hand. So then afterwards, I told my mom, okay, since I'm pretty good at this, I might as well start doing this for people. My first experience wasn't so good at all. Um, basically, when I first started out in henna, it was pretty good in, like, in my eyes and other people's eyes because I was like young. So then, you know, I like was shaky a bit and like I was nervous because it was my first time actually like performing on someone's real hand. So now that I look at it, comparing my henna now to the first henna I did before, it looks pretty bad. Good thing I improved. In my culture, usually brides get henna done like on their back or on their legs and hands, like from fingertips all the way to forearm and stuff like that. So that's all I know about it. Like usually brides get their henna done and bridesmaids, but nowadays people just get it for fun just to look cute as an accessory. All right, so the process is very, it's not long, but it's complicated if you're first starting out. So every henna is different. Usually, um, in my knowing, the Indians usually already have their henna paste made. But the henna that I use starts off as powder. I'll put it in a little sandwich bag that has like a fine tip to it. Then I would add water, mix it, mix it, mix it until I have like the right pasty consistency. So once I have that good consistency, I would tie the bag, you know, cut the tip off and like a real fine tip so that it could be like a really skinny, you know, paste on the skin. So afterwards, you know, I would just start piping the henna. Once the henna is already piped on the skin, it would dry up and then you would just peel it off the skin and it would just be done. It takes about 30 minutes for the henna to dry. I think henna is definitely becoming more and more popular today. Um, before it was just like, you know, the Indians and the Africans and the Arabians getting henna done, but nowadays everyone's trying to get their henna done because it's so popular. I see myself opening a store for henna so that many people would just come and get their henna done and stuff like that and I see myself like you know building like a little selfie corner where people would take selfies with their henna walk out the store and promote the store and stuff like that hopefully it becomes very big but you know it's a small step